All right, you guys. So this reading will be for my Gemini. Gemini sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. All right, Gemini. We're going to see what's coming up for you guys, my Gemini's. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign. All right, Gemini. Let's see. Tell me what's coming up for Gemini's moving forward. Gemini, sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign. Ooh, Gemini, we got here the nine of swords. Okay, I'm showing this is you. You could be dealing with a fellow air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'm showing you can't sleep, all right? Something is bothering you, okay, Gemini? It's bothering you in the worst way. And it's bothering you to the point that you can't stop thinking about it when you go to when you go to sleep at night or you you drift off to sleep you still think about something or this person you you still think about what was said with this nine of swords and like i said some of you guys could be dealing with another air sign gemini libra aquarius all right we got here the chariot it could be a cancer or pisces Something about a travel here, Gemini, okay? Somebody was supposed to travel to you or something about a trip. Somebody was supposed to come towards you, all right? But they ain't coming, okay? L let's be real, okay, Gemini? I'm showing that they're not coming, all right? That's why we got here the Nine of Swords because something, it was, some, it was something that was supposed to be about a travel, something fast. Watch out for the letter C, the letter S. All right, you guys, the letter T, okay, you guys? So what I'm showing here, it's about a long distance here. You can't get closer to someone. That's what I'm showing with the chariot. Like I said, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Air Sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius that you're dealing with with this chariot and the Nine of Swords energy, y'all. Tell me more about this Nine of Swords for Gemini. Tell me more about this nine of swords. We got here the king of cups. So I'm shown it's a strong water sign, all right? It's a strong water sign that you're dealing with. This is somebody, Gemini, that you got a lot of love for. You got a lot of feelings for here. And you don't want to express that to this person. You don't want to tell this person that you got a lot of love for them, that you got a lot of care for them, okay? That's what I'm showing here. Because I'm showing with this King of Cups, a lot of emotions are coming out, all right? Some things make you very emotional, all right? With this Nine of Swords energy. Somebody was supposed to show up for you, Gemini, and they don't show up. Or I'm showing that. It's not that they don't want to show up. I'm showing that it's some sort of de delay here. That's what I'm showing, Gemini. There is a delay in this connection with this person that you're dealing with, with this Nine of Swords energy. And like I said, I'm showing strong water sign energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy that you're dealing with. So I'm showing that this water, water, water sign was supposed to deliver. All right. That was supposed to deliver. All right. Tell me more about this King of Cups. We got here the Page of Pentacles, y'all. All right. We got here the Ace of Cups. Oh, look at that. Then the Ace of Pentacles wanted to pop out. Y'all, I'm showing that this person that you're dealing with, Gemini, you're dealing with someone who got a lot of love for you, okay? They got a lot of love. They got a lot of emotion. They care for you, all right? And I'm showing that they don't, they don't know that you're in this Nine of Swords energy. And if you're not in this Nine of Swords energy, it's just like you're going to feel this way because we out here to chariot, all right? Something about a travel, something is long distance, or something didn't come in in time here. And like I said, we got a page of pentacles. So this king of cups, they're going to offer you something. And I'm sure they're going to offer you this love, this affection that you want, all right? So this person, no more... No need to be in this nine of swords energy because what I'm showing is that 
this person that you're dealing with, they're going to come in, okay? They're going to come in and give you all this love. They're going to come in to give all, you all this affection, all the affection and love that you need. All right, Gemini? That's what I'm showing. I'm showing new love, <laughs> new passion and connection that this person is going to give you. And I'm showing Gemini, <coughs> excuse me, you was wondering when this person was going to give you an offer here. Okay, Gemini? Like, you was wondering when this person was going to come in and, get, you know, show you love, show you affection here with this page of pentacles. That's what I'm showing. But what I'm showing here is that this person is, they're going to come in. And like I said, we got here the Ace of Pentacles as well. So, this person is going to bring you in a solid offer here. So, no longer, no, no need to be sad. No, no, no need to be angry here with this Ace of Cups energy because this person is going to show up. Okay, Gemini. So let's go ahead and pull out this Ace of Pentacles. And then we got here the Wheel. We got here the Wheel of Fortune, y'all. All right. So a swift change. So things are going to be changing, you guys. All right, in this connection with you and this person. All right, I like this, y'all. So somebody just like, oh, not only I can, you know, offer you this love, offer you this affection, offer you this care, I can offer you stability here as well. I'm showing Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy. Doesn't have to be, but this is what I'm showing here. All right, tell me more. So you, it's like, you think that you're not going to receive this offer, Gemini, but you will. Some of you guys are dealing with a Virgo, a strong Virgo energy. You could be dealing with a fellow Gemini. So I'm showing that you're single, you're independent here. Or if you, if it's not that, you're doing something alone, you're doing something on your own here. All right. So this person, they had a plan. All right. They had a whole plan. All right. You guys with this nine of pentacles. All right, I'm showing that this person was planning something behind your back, but in a good way, you guys. All right, ooh, watch out for the number nine too as well. Nines is all about endings and new beginnings. Okay, you guys, because we got three nines here. We got the nine of swords, we got the nine of pentacles, and we got the nine of wands. So I'm showing that some of you guys could be dealing with a Sagittarius energy as well. Okay, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That, that's what I'm showing you guys, all right? So this person, they excited for what's to come, okay? I'm showing that it's like, then we got here the Ten of Swords. Remember I just said it's all about endings and new beginnings. So it's just like what you thought was over is not over, okay, you guys? That's what I'm showing here, y'all. We got here the Tower, all right? Something is bringing in unexpected change. And I'm shown it's this person that you're dealing with that's coming in that's bringing this unexpected change, but in a good way, okay, you guys? Because when I'm shown that, it's like it's going to be feeling jaded and tiring for a minute, okay, you guys, with this not a source, all right? And it, it's all come down to this person, but when I'm shown, Gemini, you're going to be good. This, this person going to make sure... You straight moving forward, all right? Baby, we got, we got two aces here. Two new beginnings here, all right? <laughs> Y'all, you cannot make this shit up, Gemini. Girl, I'm on my way. Some of you guys are dealing with a Scorpio. I got two, no, three Scorpio energy. Look, we got here to another ace. All right, so expect communication coming from this person. Yes, this person, they are in love with you, okay? That's what I'm showing. They're going to be in love with you if they're not in love with you now. Look, Gemini, this is exactly what I'm showing. This is exactly what I'm seeing here. This person is going to come towards you. They're going to see you as well. All right, you guys, I'm showing that there could be talks about making love, having sex, okay, with this Ace of Wands energy, because the Aces, it's all about new, and it, if it's the Wands, it's about a passionate 
new start, a passionate new beginning with this person that you're dealing with. And this person that you're dealing with, they're going to come in with this communication. They're going to state what they want here. All right. That's what I'm showing y'all. Let's be real. Let's just be honest. Let's just be real. So I'm showing that you're dealing with someone. Yes. Everything is going to work out, okay, Gemini? Okay, everything is going to work out with this person in your favor. All right, Gemini, this is the only thing I have for you. Please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you.